Because you probably don't have to shoot him with shock arrows, but I think I did that the last time I beat him, and it was really hard, because I only had, like, four hearts. But in this playthrough, I, I sought out the shrines first. But basically, after I beat this boss, I will be playing completely blind, because this is as far as I ever got when I was playing in portable mode when I first got the game. Past this boss is as far as I've ever gotten, like, story-wise. This is Water Blight Ganon. He's ugly as heck, and I, I wish I had a cooler-looking boss, but this'll just have to do. Dun-dun-dun. Please take care. That thing is one of Ganon's creations. I put up as much of a fight as I could, but it proved to be my demise 100 years ago. 100 years ago? Wow, that's a long time. Regardless, I believe that you are well prepared for this moment. You know it. Look at the armor I'm wearing. I'm, I'm well prepared, dude. The question is, will I suck or not? I could probably still suck. Careful, that spear has a Shock arrows, baby. Zombie. I was hoping for a perfect dodge in a, in a like, flurry rush or whatever, but that takes practice. There, lock on. That'll help. There we go. Sweet. How come the flurry rush didn't work? Why am I still what? I pressed the Y button. Like, what did I do wrong? Seriously, how come it wasn't a, a successful flurry rush? Oh, well. We can do this to him. That does some damage. Good grief. That attack, I think, used to be instant death or something. But now with this armor and stuff, I take a whole lot less damage, which is nice. All right, dude. Do your worst. Do the thing. Flurry rush, flurry rush, flurry rush. I don't know why you didn't do this the first time you had the chance. I was pressing the button. No, don't sneak. Run at full speed. Oh, did my sword break already? I didn't realize it broke. I was trying to throw it. I didn't. I thought it didn't break yet. Okay. Should I use this? This is the strongest weapon I have. Let's do it, dude. I've been saving this weapon for a boss fight. That's why I haven't used it. Not one. I haven't even used it one time. I'm saving it for something like this. He's not dead already, is he? Okay, maybe not dead. He's going on to phase two. That's right, because there is a second phase. Where's he at, dude? Oh, there he is. Hello. Dude, you missed me. Oh, you did not miss me. How, what? Did that thing home in? All right, we're going to need this. I actually guess I already had that equipped. Activate. Oh, I can't use the rune in the water. Good grief, I'm going to freaking die. Just climb up. Get out of the water. I can't do anything unless you get out of the freaking water. There, let's get him. He's falling, right? Did that not work? What the heck? Oh. Why is he directly above me? That's annoying. Well, there goes one of my fairies. Yep, I knew I was gonna suck at this. What am I supposed to do then if arrows don't work? Oh, that was a waste. I guess he teleported away just as I fired. Ow. I never was any good at this boss. I don't know how I ever beat him with only four hearts. Oh, it does home in. That's crazy, dude. Defend yourself against those ice blocks. I would if the thing would activate. There we go. Well, I need, I need a new bow now. Honestly, dude, if you could fall down or something, that would be cool. Are you okay? I don't even want to continue this fight anymore. I don't want to sacrifice all my fairies on this. That's not the point of this. I'm wearing armor and I have a strong weapon. The whole idea was to avoid all that. See, he appears behind you, so that if you're coming back again, you have to remember to walk backwards or whatever. Oh, 
Rush him, rush him. There. Guardian sword broke. Cool. Let's pick another weapon. Like, maybe I should only sacrifice the weakest weapons against fights like this. I don't know. There. Doesn't really matter what weapon I use if I'm flurry rushing. Assuming I can get that right. Well, dodging it is better than nothing. Like, even if you don't get the flurry rush, at least dodge so you don't get hit. I guess if you're just dodging it, I guess you don't have to jump for that one. Or is he just hitting my shield? He might be hitting my shield. I'm probably wearing out my shield. Rush him, rush him, rush him. Nice. Time for phase two. I don't know what to do in phase two. Like what actually do? How do you knock him down? Careful. Not much room to knock him down. Like, get up, get up, get up. I'm gonna have to break some ice, right? Oh, those are ice arrows? I don't want ice arrows. Why do I have those equipped? If anything should be equipped, it should be the shock arrows. What the heck? Ow. While I'm busy equipping stuff, he's gonna stab me. You just had to appear above me, you jerk. Dude. Ah! Well, I'll keep shooting him, I guess. Okay, I totally jumped. That should have been a dodge. Get out of the water. There we go. Okay, what the heck? I believe this calls for defense up. Food. Defense up. Where is defense up? There it is. There's my defense thing. Man, I could have that many hearts, but that's kind of overkill. All right, baby, it's go time. Can you throw the blocks back at him? Not that I know of. How would I do that? I pressed the jump button and I didn't jump. Why didn't you jump? Jump, it's not that hard. Stop appearing above me, dude. Get out of the water. Turn around. Good grief. I hate this fight so much. Defend yourself against those ice blocks. There, at least I dodged it. Oh, what the heck? He fell down. Why didn't that happen sooner? Because I remember being able to do that, but it just wasn't happening. What the heck, dude? Get out of the water. Oh, hello. You won't be able to hit me as long as I'm moving, dude. I know how these things work. Aha, you missed me. You completely missed me. Good job. Nice jump, Link. You failed to even dodge. What the heck? 
Like, that that should have been a dodge, even though it was a stupid dive. Like, he should have not been able to hit me there. Alright. Have another shock arrow. Okay. These just randomly knock him down sometimes, not all the time. You're finished, dude. Oh my goodness. Like, really, man. Can we just be done? Oh, by the way, Wolven, welcome. You and Tiro Flame had the same chat color, so I didn't even know it was you at first. My apologies. You're the one suggesting I throw the blocks back, and I was just thinking in the back of my head, what's the matter, Tiro Flame? How come you don't know? You've played this game more than I have. But then I realized you're not him. Duh. Oh my goodness. But no, you can't throw the blocks back at him. The only thing you can do with those blocks is smash them with your ice ability ice ability thing. Now I have even more hearts. I have nine now instead of eight. I love heart containers. They're freaking amazing. I don't know how I ever... How did I ever beat this boss with only four or five hearts? Because the first time I played this boss, that's how many hearts I had. was barely anything. And the rest of my defense is going to be wasted. But I guess that's just how it goes. Once you activate the main control unit, you will not be able to re-enter the divine interior of this divine beast. So basically that means, I think, like once you leave the dungeon, that's it. You can never come back for any chests or anything that you wanted to get. And if you leave without getting the heart container, I guess you lose that heart container forever. I guess they just wanted to make that abundantly clear. Because of your courage, my spirit is now free. And Ruta as well. Thank you. For I am now allowed by this freedom to be with you once again. She's so sweet. Since I am now a spirit, my healing power would be wasted on me. I have no need of it. So therefore, I would like you to have it. Please accept Mipha's grace. <sighs> Yesterday, I was awash in a pool of tears. I had nearly given up hope and resigned myself to being trapped here as a spirit. For the rest of eternity. But now you're here. All this time my hope was to see you once more. Promise me that you will not hesitate to call upon my power if you ever find yourself in need. Knowing that will let my spirit rest in peace. I must go. I must go. My Bruce people need me. I have all roles to fulfill. Huh. We are both honored to be able to play the role of support. We'll annihilate Ganon together. Farewell. Save her, Link. Save the princess. Save Princess Zelda. Mipha's Grace, if I remember right, it, uh automatically revives you when you die and with bonus hearts so it's kind of like in, like a super overpowered fairy but i think once that happens it takes a while to recharge or something before you can use it again i don't know because after i got this far in the game i didn't go any further in my first playthrough and then when i, st I started over to stream so yeah i think that's pretty much the gist of it
Wait, 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 wait. Is that that's a shrine? That's the, that glowy orange thing down there is a shrine that I have not beaten. I need to find that and do it. Robot elephant is alive or something. That's what I call it. I call it the robot elephant. This is clearly an elephant and clearly a robot. Whoosh! Ruta, we found a way to be useful to Link and the other champions, of course. Our job will be to help Link as he fights Ganon inside the castle, however we can. Using your ability to drain Ganon of his power is key to our success. This is it. This will be our last chance, and everyone's last hope. If we seal him away, then we can restore peace to Hyrule. And both your duty and mine will be fulfilled. Father, are you well, I wonder? I want you to know I have always followed my heart. I'm sorry I made you worry. I wish I could see you again. Even just once more. It's, it's kind of cool how it's shooting a red laser towards the castle. Or something. Whoa. You got the thing! I was not ready for that, otherwise I could have been in perfect sync. Anyway, a restorative power born from the spirit of the champion Mitha. When your hearts run out, you'll automatically be resurrected with full, heart, full health plus temporary bonus hearts. Nice. The Hylian that Prince Sidon brought here, don't tell me. Ah! Master Link! Is it truly you, the Hylian champion? Yes. Oh, I've already talked to this guy before. Ah. It has been 100 years since then, and now I'm over 130 years old. Zoras really live that long? That's pretty crazy. Shouldn't you be dead? <laughs> what ah. kind of question is that? Oh, man. Baz. Hmm. Oh, but Master Link, you probably shouldn't speak to the elderly. Sorry for keeping you too long. You have business in the throne room, right? Please please proceed there at your earliest convenience. Like, I'm not sure if I have business in the throne room or not. I did just free the Divine Beast, so I think we're done here, but... <clears throat> I might as well visit the throne room again. Who knows? Maybe I'm supposed to. Probably am, actually. A cutscene is happening, I think. <laughs> Link, you did well to survive your trial. I have been awaiting your return. The violent downpour has disappeared, as has the threat to Zora's domain. It is all little more than a bad dream now. Thanks to your efforts, there is no longer any danger of a great flood laying waste to Hyrule. You appeased the divine beast Varuda and thusly saved Zora's domain. <laughs> we are all truly grateful. What you did for us is more than we could have ever expected of you. Link, I must sincerely apologize for my harsh treatment of you. That whole time you were thinking of Hyrule's and Lady Mipha's well-being, just like the rest of us. All the members of our council humbly fold our fins back in gratitude, along with the rest of our people. Perhaps the older generation of Zora, myself included, misunderstood Hylians after all. It would seem so. That said, I would be overjoyed if you could find it in your heart to forgive me. If not now, then perhaps one day. <laughs> Link, I must reward your efforts. I implore you to collect the treasure inside the chest. Oh... A memento? I may have gotten this before, but I forget what it is. By the way, Link, I see you are without your trusty blade, the sword that seals the darkness, the Master Sword. Did you perhaps lose it when you lost your memory? What sword? Hmm. 
That is a legendary blade that only you, the Hylian Champion, can wield. There's no doubt resting somewhere in Hyrule even now, waiting for its master to return. <laughs> Link, all the Zora thank you from the depths of our hearts for your heroic and selfless work. Mm. And you too, Sidon. <laughs> As your father, I'm proud of you for fighting the Divine Beast alongside Link. You have grown much recently. I know you'll be a worthy heir when your time comes. <gasps> father, I... I thank you. The heavy rains have stopped, and the Divine Beast is our ally once again. How glorious, truly splendid. Wahaha. Splendid. Splendid. Link, this is wonderful. I love that charismatic pose. Or whatever that is. I just love that. Truly, I could never thank you enough. You helped save our home from vanishing away. This calls for a top tier expression of gratitude. Zozo, ra ra ra, with all my heart, thank you. Fus Roda! I'm just kidding, it's not Skyrim. So happy, dude. Look, they're all just so happy. Complete. I would really love to find the Master Sword. I would really love to find the Master Sword. I just don't know where to go. Oh, light scale trident. About, I almost expected it to say your inventory is full, but I guess I broke enough weapons during the fight. So that's a decently strong weapon. Level attack, attack level 22. It's weaker than a lot of these and equal with the thunder blade. That's worth hanging on to, though. I will probably use it after this one breaks. Knight's halberd looks so cool, though. I'm gonna miss this weapon when it breaks, because it just looks so cool. A lot, I mean, a lot of the weapons look really cool, but... I don't know, I just really like the one I have now. But that's too bad. Eventually it will just be a memory, once it breaks. 